Good morning, Remnant Connection. God bless you. This is Jackie in Oregon. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for joining, subscribing. And if you could remember your thumbs up and what I've noticed with all the comments and I'm trying to do my very best to answer everybody. God is in control. Amen. If I miss some here and there, you know, you know that I'm a one one gal show here. But anyway, I've noticed how many of you are praying for others as you uh, write your comments and go through the comments. And I thank you for that. I thank you for your prayers here, uh, for your steadfastness. And we are in the last days and these are hard days. God told us these days were coming. Amen. So we're here to encourage each other. Uh, anything negative, I'm just going to remove it from the channel. Uh, I don't have time to read the garbage, and I know that you don't need to read it either. Amen. We're the remnant, and we fit together like a glove, and we're here to love and encourage each other. Amen. So just a few minutes. It, some of you have asked how you donate on the channel. That's in the super thanks in the comments. You'll see those three dots. If you're being blessed by these messages, that's a way to give. And then the mail ministry. Oh, my goodness. I was sharing with the viewer the post box. I've had to change boxes. The post office is further away. So the other day I said, well, I'll go over there two days a week. And then yesterday I said, well, I'll go over there three days a week. I only got the small box. I should have got the drawer. Amen. And then I keep hearing more and more today that you're going to be writing. So I think I'm going every day. <laughs> but praise God. This is why I know God has me at this desk. Amen. And God's going to do it if I have to hire a little teenager to help me on, uh, you know, the mailer days with the addresses. That's what I'll do. God is so good. God is on a move because our time is short. Amen, church. So bless each one of you. Uh, bless each one of you and thank you for your prayers. So today's message, I'm going to read to you out of Psalm 37. It's a long Psalm. So I'll read probably three to 11. And the title is the mark of a godly man, the mark of a godly man. So, oh, one more thing before, before I forget, somebody sent me a check in Remnant Connection and I returned it. I, I don't have a business account. So that's why once you write, I will give you my information. Amen. So uh, I'm sorry to interrupt, but I did. I wanted to let some of you new, new, newer viewers know that. Okay, so don't send me any checks and I'll avoid them and send it back to you. You know, there's no problem at all, but wanted to let you know that. So backing up Psalm 37, the mark of a godly man. And number three here, verse three, trust in the Lord and do good. Dwell in the land and cultivate faithfulness. And that's what I believe we're doing here. One to another, as you comment, we're cultivating faithfulness. Amen. Delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires of your heart. Commit your way to the Lord and trust in him and what he will do. And he will bring forth your righteousness as the light and your judgment as the new day. Rest in the Lord and wait patiently for him. Do not fret because of him who prospers in his way, because of the man who carries out wicked schemes. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry, folks. Verse 8. Cease from anger and forsake wrath. Do not fret. It leads only to evil doing. And evildoers will be cut off, but those who wait upon the Lord will inherit the land. Praise God. We're almost there, church. We're almost there. Verse 10. Yet for a little while, the wicked man will do no more. And it will look and you will look. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Almighty God. Bless your people. Bless each one today, Lord God. Blood covering be upon them, Lord God. Lord, let them receive just what you have for them today as I read the word, Lord God. Bless and keep each one and all of their family. <coughs> Excuse me, folks. The mark of a godly man. You will know him by his fruits. Glory to God. You will know him by his heart. Once one with a heart after God yielded and pliable, one with love for his fellow man, a heart much like his beloved Savior, precious, kind, and long suffering for the lost and difficult. Glory to God. And then there are the others, those with the heart only striving to serve themselves, unyielded. <coughs> Excuse me, folks. I'm so sorry. 
I think I'm through it. Let me back up. Those with the heart only striving to serve themselves, unyielded heart and by a life of hurt. These hurts buried deep within carried for a lifetime. So that's something we have to look for in men is they come at us really hard. You know, they bury their hurts. We have a place to go. We have a place where all hurts are washed away and taken and that's their choice. They have that same place. But we have to recognize, you know, where they're at. Let me back up a little bit. Those with the heart once striving, pardon me, those with the heart only striving to serve themselves, unyielded, hardened by a life of hurt. These hurts buried deep within carry for a lifetime, holding on to bitterness as a defense, a weapon to ward off the needy. Isn't that interesting? That one jumped out at me. Holding on to bitterness as a defense, a weapon to ward off the needy, woe to them. And all the while, a loving God with his hand extended outward, a God who gave his life for all of the hurts and all of mankind over all of generations. Glory to God. Oh, my people, how you can look back now and how you can lift up holy hands with a heart filled to overflowing gratitude and thanks. Praise God. You are my people. I am your God. My lamb, you know my voice and you know my plan ahead. The roadmap before you within my pages. Fear not. Look back often to understand your days for the future. Say, man, what we've been through before, we may go through again, especially with the attacks of the enemy. He's he's an enemy of repetition. That's what I'll call him. Praise God. Your heart has been broken in order to be healed. Oh, my love, I am with you. Uh, please, that how far you have come, glory to God, I see your faithful heart. Oh, faith, only faithful now, because you have been broken in order to make you whole. You are my child, miles of head, uh, miles ahead of many because you trust and your willingness glory to God oh my love do not hold this secret within your heart go out to the stiff neck upon the streets their hardened hearts unkind words uh, their only defense now glory to God you understand my spirit is within you the rebellious world word their only defense their rebellious words, their only defense, their way of standing against the fears deep within them. Such an interesting word. They are watching my people. They are watching my words through your lips going deep within their spirits. They are quickly becoming weary in their rebellious ways. Glory to God. Isn't that how many of us got saved and born again? We were weary in our rebellion. It takes a lot of energy to fight against God. Amen. Praise God. The enemy within them causing great weariness within them. Be wise, my lambs. The dying are watching now even more than ever before. Glory to God. The days are few. They see with their eyes. They hear your words of hope and peace. Now, my church, you will be surprised at the ones that come. Even the hardest will fall down before, uh, before me, my loves. Remember your days past. Remember your hardness of heart. Glory to God. So, my lamb, let me love you each day. Let me change you each day, my loves. Let me break you again if need be. I will draw you unto me and change you again as you are marked by my spirit set apart for such a day as this glory. Yes, turmoil rising, even evil words coming against my people. Nothing changes within the hearts of dying men. But many will see, many are watching, many know that you are set apart from a dying world, glory to God. Even the dying see your fruits, isn't that interesting? Even the dying see your fruits, even now watching and, and drawn to that peace and hope. Seek me early and seek me late, be filled with all of me, my loves. No, you are known by your fruits, my goodness within you, you are my people, my lambs. I see your love for the lost, I am well pleased glory to God stay now ever so close in these final days let no man uh, listen to no man seek my wisdom and knowledge and direction for your days do not fear do not weary come to my side often for your refreshment cling to those who love you remember I am your first love uh, and I, I love you be quick and 
in gentleness, my gentleness to love the lost, no matter what, their words, they are watching, they are listening, they are frightened and weary. The enemy is stealing them away. You have the mark of a godly man. They're all watching. Glory to God. Thank you, Lamb of God. <clears throat> Thank you, Lamb of God. Thank you, Lamb. Thank you, Lamb of God. You will know, pardon me, sec uh, second reading. The mark of a godly man, you will know him by his fruits, glory to God. You will know him by his heart with uh, with a heart after God yielded and pliable, one with love for his fellow man, a heart much like his beloved Savior, precious, kind, long-suffering for the lost and difficult, glory to God. And then there are others, those with the heart only serving uh, themselves unyielded, hardened by a life of hurt. These hurts buried deep within, carried for a lifetime, holding on to bitterness as a defense, a weapon to ward off the needy. Woe to them. All the while, a loving God with his hand extended outward. The God who gave his life and for all the hurts and for all of mankind over all of generations. Glory to God. Oh, my people, now you can look back and now you can lift up holy hands with a heart filled with overflowing gratitude and thanks. Glory to God. You are my people. I am your God, my lamb. You know my voice. You know my plan ahead. The roadmap before you within written within my pages. Fear not. Look back often to understand your days for the future your heart has been broken in order to be healed oh my love i am well pleased and how far you have come i see your faithful hearts glory to god only faith uh only faithful now because you have been broken in order to make you like your god you are my child miles ahead of many because you trust and you are willing Glory to God. Oh, my love, do not hold this secret within your heart. Go out to the stiff neck upon the streets. Their hearts hardened, unkind words, their only defense. Now, glory to God. You understand my spirit is within you. The rebellious words, their only defense, their only way of standing against the fears that are deep within them. So good. They're watching, my people. They're watching. My words through your lips going deep within their spirits. They are quickly becoming weary in their rebellious ways. Glory to God. The enemy within them causing great weariness within them. Be wise, my lambs. The dying are waiting now even more than ever. Glory to God. The days are few. They see with their eyes. They hear with their words. Of uh, They hear your words of hope and peace. And now, my church, you will be surprised. Those that will come. Even the heart will fall down before me, my love. Remember your days past. Remember your hardness of heart. So my lambs, let me love you each day. Let me change you each day, my loves. Let me break you again if need be. I will draw you unto me and change you again as you are marked by my spirit. Set apart for such a day as this glory. Yes, the turmoil rising, evil, evil words coming against my people. Nothing changes within the hearts of dying men, but Many will see, many are watching, many know that you are set apart from a dying world. Glory to God. Even the dying see your fruits, even now watching and drawing to your peace and hope. Seek me early, seek me late. Be filled with me, my love. No, you are known by your fruits. My goodness within you, you are my people, my lambs. Uh, I see your love for the lost. I'm well pleased. Glory to God. Stay now ever so close in these final days. Listen to no man. Seek my wisdom and knowledge and direction for your days ahead. Do not fear. Do not weary. Come to my side often for refreshment. Cling to those who love you. Remember, I am your first love. Love as I love. Be quick in gentleness, my gentleness, gentleness to love others, no matter what their words. They are watching. They are listening. They are frightened and weary. The enemy is stealing them away, and you have the mark of a godly man. They are watching. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank you, almighty God. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus, for your presence today. Thank you for each one listening. Thank you for each family represented here, Lord God. We lift up our children, our mates, our grandchildren, our nieces and nephews, our friends, Lord God, that have not uh, called out 
and repent it in your name, Lord God. We lay them each at your altar, Lord God, and we pray and we believe, Lord God, you are a God of salvation. You shed your blood for those that we love. We lift them up to you that they might be saved, Lord God. Lord, that all is in your hands in these last and closing days. All is in your hands, Lord God. I pray that you would heal your people, Lord God, that you would heal them body, mind, and spirit, Lord God, that they would be open, Lord God, each one of us, that we would be broken and open, Lord God, to be changed more like you, Lord God. That's all that matters, Lord, that you are in our life, that you are working in us and through us, Lord God, and that we stand to the best of our ability, Lord God, and we trust you with our whole heart, our whole soul, and all of our mind. Touch each one, the blood covering, protect each one from the darts of the enemy this day and time. Thy will be done. Thy will be done in our lives this day and time. In Jesus' name, amen and amen and amen. God bless you. His light shine upon you. Be safe today. Thank you for your thumbs up. Thank you for subscribing. Bless each one. You're all precious. You're all an ultra rare bird in God's eyes. That word, that 60-day word just really went on this channel. You are. You all talk about what an ultra rare bird you are. You certainly are. God loves you with his whole heart, all of his heart, a rare bird you are in the kingdom of God. God bless you. Take care today. We'll talk again very soon. God bless.